What's up, guys? Danny Jones. I was just getting back from the gym, and I got a three-way call and uh, from a new brand partner, and it just dawned on me um, the revelation that I got because there's so many new people who are trying to succeed by themselves with this, and uh, you got to stop. <laughs> this is a team sport. We all work together, and uh, I think this will just make a lot easier for you uh, to do the business. So I think a lot of people, the new, especially some of the older people that have been in for a while, they're trying to be the expert with the warm market. Um, good luck with that. It doesn't work. It will never work just because it. Um, they trust you, they like you, but they don't respect you in this business yet. Um, third party is always going to be more uh, powerful than first party. So I'm going to give you some whys and then some how-tos of how to do the correct follow-up and the three-way call and how to really set it up so that you can get the most success out of it. This is going to be really quick. Um, first of all, the whole point, um, let me tell you what the point is not about the three-way call. Um, it's not for me to sell them. It's not uh, to, to sign them up. It's, I'm not the closer. That's not the whole point of it. Um, there's four reasons if you're taking notes of why to do the three-way call. And um, number one is just to hear another person's story. It's a, it's a second witness. Prospects, they need validation, 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 validation. They need validation um, constantly, okay? Because they just watched a video that says this is awesome. You're telling them it's awesome. But they're still going to be um, not quite convinced yet some of the time. So they need more and more people to tell them that it's good. Um, just think about when you go shopping, okay? You try on a, a dress or a shirt. You know, your friend says, hey, that looks pretty good. You still might be kind of on the fence. But if you got five people telling you, hey, that looks pretty awesome on you, you just bought it. Okay, so more validation, the better. Number two is to edify you as a brand partner. Okay, the, the expert is going to probably tell your prospect that they're really excited to work with you. And it, it really shows this unique social aspect that we all work together as a team. And people want to be a part of a team. Uh, number three, it's, uh, it moves them to the next exposure. So uh, we all know it's five to seven exposures before someone actually signs up. So um, a three-way call is probably going to be their second or third exposure, which is good because it's going to move them forward. Um, and fourth, it actually subtly shows them how to do the business. It shows them how simple it is and it keeps it duplicatable. So your prospect is thinking, wow, you just started, you're already having success, and uh, all you did was show me a video and um, you got me on the phone with somebody else that was really down to earth and got my questions answered. That's pretty comfortable and, and you, you're busy, hey, I'm busy, I could do this. So that's uh, a huge point right there. So when you're following up, there's um, really what you, the way it's going to go is when you call them up, it's going to be urgent, and you're going to say, hey, what did you like best? That should be the, probably like the first question that you ask them. What part did you like best? Um, awesome. Whatever they say, you're just going to say, you know what? I'm so glad you said that. They say, I like the product. I like the results. I like the Lexus. Um, I like this. You say, you know what? I'm really glad you said that. Um, even if it's negative, they say, well, I don't know if I have the time, I don't have the money, uh, I don't know if it's one of those type of businesses I can do, hey, I'm kind of shy. Well, no matter what they say, hey, I'm so glad you said that. You know what? I was actually just talking with my friend Danny about you. You got to meet him. I think you totally relate. So I'm so glad you said that. I was just talking with my friend Danny. You got to meet him. Um, and you say something nice about me, okay? Um, just think of something. Maybe you can. Maybe you can't think of anything nice to say about me. But whoever you're, you're getting on the phone, just say something nice about me. Speak well, okay? Don't make this such a big, heavy deal. You don't have to say like, "Hey, um, I, you know, I really want to get you on someone important here. You know, just listen to them. They can get you signed up. You know, I think you'd really need to talk to him." It's putting so much pressure on them. Just keep it light and fun and quick, okay? So there's like seven words that I kind of throw in there that um, you just should kind of just roll off your tongue, just practice them. So uh, the words are busy, earth, fun, successful, relate, story, and two minutes. Busy, earth, fun, successful, relate, story, and two minutes. And, um, you know, you can even, you know, think of it like, hey, relate a successful story about the earth in a fun way in two minutes. Um, but just, it's going to sound something like this. They say, uh, you call them up, um, hey, I just, wanted, I just wanted to see, um, I saw you watch the video, hey, what part, I just had a couple minutes, here. what part did you like the best? You know, it looks pretty good, um, I like those results there, but, you know, I'm just not really sure, I, I don't know, I've got my full-time job and my kids, I just, I don't know if I can really do the business. You know what, I'm so glad you said that, I was actually just on the, on the phone with uh, my friend Danny, he's actually had a lot of success, you gotta meet him, he's really busy, he's super down to earth, he's fun. He's successful, but um, I really think that you'd relate with him. You gotta hear his story. You know, let me see if I can get him for two minutes. You see how simple and natural that was, and um, 
and you know it's just it's just a quick call you know hey you gotta hear this so let me see if I can get them real quick hang on for let me see if I can get them for two minutes boom you're not asking them you know would you like to talk to my friend first before you say no to me um, <laughs> you're just gonna say you know what oh great you like that great you know what you gotta hear my friend's story real quick I think he'd really relate with them he's actually had quite a bit of success he's pretty busy He's super down to earth. Let me see if I can get him for two minutes. Oh my gosh, I was just talking to him about you. I think he'd really relate. Um, and just you're just passing the ball. You're getting in that rhythm of you're exposing, you're following up in your three-way. Expose, follow up, three-way. Expose, follow up, three-way. Um, just pass the ball. You know, the, at the end of a game basketball, they're always passing the ball to Michael Jordan back in the day or Kobe or whatever. Um, just pass the ball. Get it off of you. It's, it's third party. Um, everyone I have right now that is signing up in the business, it's usually either right after a three-way or a couple days after the three-way. Um, and I have also other new brand partners that are telling me, you know, they've done a couple three-ways with me and they say, you know what, I'm never going to stop doing this because this is working so well. And, um, and I encourage them to stop doing it, uh, to never stop doing it because it just, it just works really, really well. It's duplicatable for the same reasons I was just talking about. So, guys... Love you. Keep doing it. Expose, follow up through it. Just pass the ball. And I'll see you guys soon.